Hi, I'm Tina Mickelson, and as a teaching pro, I've seen many amateurs struggle with a longer chip shot onto the green. Emma Talley has a great tip for using your 8-iron to get you on the green and hopefully close to your target. Yeah, I think I see so many amateurs just pick out their 58 degree and try to land it all the way over the hill and hit a flop shot or try to bump and run it even with a 58. And today I'm going to show you a shot with my 8-iron. And even if the pin was just a few steps ahead of me, I could still use the same shot but use my 58 degree or pitching wedge. So um, the shot is basically you're going to pick up your right foot and put just your toe on the ground and you're going to pick up the heel of the club. So heel of the club is off the ground and you're going to just put your foot just like this. And then you're just basically going to put it with your toe. The, the toe of the club is the only thing that's going to hit the ground. So I'm going to pick my spot out and then I'm going to keep my weight where it is and keep that foot up like I have it. And that should be pretty perfect. That looks great. We have a shorter chip shot here. Basically, same idea, different distance. Exactly, yeah. Okay. Um, basically, we have a couple yards. Some people would putt it, which is okay, but actually I think you can get closer with the 58 degree doing the exact same thing we just did with the 8 iron in front of the green. It's a little downhill, um, and this one's going to go higher and stop quicker. I'm using my 58 this time. Hill off the ground once again. Hill of my foot off the ground. And then keep your weight there. Mm. Oof, almost made it. So just like that, it's much easier um, downhill shot instead of kind of chunking it or hitting it thin from a very short distance. So remember, lift your back heel and the heel of the club, take a short swing back and through, and run it up onto the green. And you can do the same shot from a shorter distance with a 58 degree wedge.